Howdy folks, welcome to episode 32. Today we're going to see if we can get some more of this, all this chores done so that we can get our, uh, you know, our moving stuff. It's not really a chore, but you know what I mean, our moving, moving our stuff. So, uh, let's see, errands. Errands would be the word for that. See if we can get some more errands done. So we're going to go for, we got to get past this switch over here so we can load up our iron. And then I'm not sure if we should attach the other engine or what. We'll have to see. What's what are the other the other cars or the cordwood cars? Maybe we can bring the cordwood cars up here and try to run two engines. I mean that could be interesting running two engines without having the controls for them because we basically have to just put one on. Um, why is this? Are we? Oh, we're going up a little bit of a hill. That's why. Let me see. There we go. Okay. I'm like, why are we going so <laughs> so slowly and stopping and stuff? I was thinking maybe we had some brakes on or something. Okay. Yeah, I think that's maybe what we'll do is we'll get the other car with... And maybe we'll leave the cordwood cars over here on this line. And then bring both engines, do a double engine thing so that we can pull them up. I'll have to see which, which engines have what what uh, attractive effort again and what we can pull okay so we're going to come up on the other side I believe we already flipped the switch yeah we did flip the switch yeah that's the Tweety I think we can do that I think we can we might even swap engines I think that's what we'll do is we'll swap engines we'll bring these up and then we'll um, use the Tweety to uh, and I'll have to figure that out how to put that on the front of this because we're going to have to get this other engine out of here but yeah we'll do that and then we can um because i think that has a lot more tractive effort than this one i think we just got this one because it was newer or whatever we'll see we'll check it out i think this one has a little less all right yeah because that's what 130 on the boiler the boiler only goes up to 130, so yeah, it may be. Alright. And let's hope we don't crash on the... I, I, we seem to... Whatever was going on with that track before, it seems to be fixed, so I don't think we're going to be crashing on that. Alright, so we need to bring up these cars. Are those the ra The rails are the first one. Okay. And we're going to have to figure out where... I can't even tell where these cars are from this angle. This is like the worst angle ever. Um, that doesn't help either. Okay, let's go, just go see. Oh, we gotta do this too. Keep forgetting to do that. That's the bell. Where's the, there it is. <laughs> Five minutes to that. All right, if, in case anybody already hadn't figured out the, that the car was stopped. Okay, so we gotta bring this all the way down to the end of this thing and we have 22 of them. Okay. So let's put a sign right here. See if we can get a sign here. Stop. And we're gonna put a stop sign. We want the back of the car to be right here. Whoops, I did it again. <laughs> sign, stop, there we go. And I think the sun's gonna set on us. The sun's gonna go down and we're gonna have to do this in the dark. Too bad you can't have a, like a lantern that you can sit down on the ground somewhere, right? There. Okay. Can we? There we go. All right. So can we see what? We kind of go like this. I need to use the hands on that, the keyboard for that, not the mouse, so I can keep the mouse on the brake. That looks like it's about there. Let's see if that does it. Because I think we were maybe half a car length. No, we weren't even close. Yeah, we were not even close, are we? Nope, not really. Okay. Let's see if these will load up freight, though. Nope, they won't load freight. <laughs> they won't even do it. They're like, screw you guys. Yeah. All right. So we just got to get this, yeah, half car length. Okay. We'll get it there eventually. 
<laughs> as this as we're burning daylight here. All right, we're gonna go like this. We're gonna go half a car length. There, that should do it. We'll see if that'll do it. I don't know if they actually, when they're doing that at the yard, when they're adjusting like that, would they bother doing all the whistle stuff or? <laughs> I almost called it whistle crap, but then somebody would be like, crap, it's not crap. Dump, bushwood. <laughs> right? Okay, I think it's only three of them per thing. Yeah, it's only three per car. Okay, all right. Dump, bushwood. <sighs> Looks good on you, though. Okay. <laughs> we got to come back two car lengths. Okay, so we need the tender to be right over here, or the first back of the first car to be parallel with that. That's easy enough, right? Back of the first car to be parallel with that, because that'll line us up. There's one. We got one more car length to go. A little bit more. There we go. Let's try that. Yeah, I don't know if they bother with that when when uh, they're doing that stuff. Let's see. Did I manage to get between cars? No. Okay. That's fine, too. That works, too. Really wish you could do that from the interface. All right. So we're going to bring it back to here and then yeah we're gonna bring it back so th are we gonna miss one we're gonna miss one that was weird that was really weird wasn't it what is it doing huh I was gonna say I wish we could do this where we can put here like this see we can get the other one on there I think they made it so that it doesn't subtract the things from the, there we go. It doesn't subtract the things from the, from the factory. Can we get it? Oh man, it is so dark. Where's our generator? Do we have a generator on this one? This one doesn't have a generator, does it? I'm not seeing it. Okay. Let's get out there and see what's going on here. Is it gonna Did it just did it just do exactly what I said it wasn't gonna do? And drop We got three because we had twenty two of them. Six. We have three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen. Yeah, we got screwed. We get we're missing four. So that one needs four on it, and the second one needs four on it. So you know what? I'm going to go, because we got robbed on that, so I'm going to go fix that, and, <laughs> and I will be right back. <laughs> okay, we're back, and we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight cars. So I got 22. I ended up, I guess, cheating into... Raw iron. Oh no. No, I'm not a badass because, you know, I cheated in a train game and stuff. Because playing video games makes you tough and stuff. Anyway, um. <laughs> for those of you who only watched. who only watched this. me play this game, it's. It's just kind of a running joke because, like, I used to play survival games. I still play them, but I just haven't done it on the channel for a while. But, yeah, people would get all, like, you know, I'm I'm tough and stuff because I play a survival game in, in this way. And that makes me a, you know, a hard ass or something. Whatever. <laughs> like, okay. Sure, sure thing, buddy. <laughs> wish I could be tough like you. Alright, so should we take, I think what we can do is we can take the, the engine out 
and put it in front. Yeah, we'll take the tweetsie out in front. And then we can, um, in front of this, and then we can uh, see if we can maybe park the other cars back there. Let's see if we can do that. I'm going to try to park those cars back there, so that's going to be interesting because remember, that's where it was crashing a bunch. What episode was that, like 7 or something? It was way back when. Way back in the olden times. All right. Back when they were still using steam power. Um, let's get this loaded. Get it fueled, that is. It's freezing. The, the water in the boiler is freezing because it's at zero Celsius. <laughs> okay, that joke never gets old, by the way. Um, let's see, just FYI. So, yeah, I think we can just leave the... We can leave the cars here. We're going to put them on the center s switch. And we're going to try to leave them here. And see what happens. So... There we go. We're going to back this up. And... See, there's only five of them. It kind of, I'm kind of tempted to bring those with out to the other thing, but I don't think we're going to need these for quite a long time. I'm not sure how, how long, if we'll need them at all. We'll see. So if we do, we can just come and get them. There's, what, six of them? I think there's seven. Seven of those cards. Okay. Almost there. We gotta get that out of the fall. We'll get those all the way out of the fall. There we go. I know it's like I'm so proud it's like the one railroad term that I actually use correctly. <laughs> so you know. <laughs> gotta take advantage of that. Alright. <laughs> instead of all my other made up terms. Okay, so we're gonna open the couple or we're gonna en enter. We should be probably up to temperature now. Whoops, did I just do that? Did I do that? No, nope. yeah, I did. Okay, I gotta do this again because I, I forgot to change gears. Because <laughs> I'm a genius. All right. <laughs> Too busy talking about other stuff. Okay, let's try this. There we go. Couplers sure are a lot more effective than they used to be. All right, and it was right over here where we were crashing before, but I think that's taken care of. Because it was doing some weird, it was colliding with some invisible thing too. So who knows? Anyway, let's get this up here. What's our what's our fire temperature over here? Oh, there it is, 234. Yeah, okay, our boiler's up. All right, we're good. And then we'll do... Yeah, okay, I can't do the things with the keyboard, the brakes. All right, we'll get this switched over to here. I'm trying to think of... Oh, you know what? We can do... Yeah, why don't we do... Should we do both engines? Let's do both engines for the fun of it. I think we should. All right, so we're gonna open that. And then, oops, we're gonna switch this. And then we're gonna put up the coupler on this. Yeah, it looks like it's open, okay. So we'll see if we can do it. Because that should be interesting, trying to manage up, up and down the hills and stuff like that. But that'll get our engines together and stuff, too. Did I tell you the control... The control key. By the way. <laughs> the control to key does the whistle. Um, let me see. I only know that because control minus... Control numpad minus, so basically I have to hit opposite ends of the keyboard to turn off my recording, and when I turned off my recording, it started whistling a couple episodes ago, and I'm like, what is that? There we go. Are we going to get it? Did we couple? I think we coupled. All right, so we're going to leave the regulator off on this one. And can we get out here? 
Yeah, it looks like it's doing it. Okay. So we're going to go like this. We're going to leave the other engine off when it's not needed. Let's see if this will do it. Cool. Cool. Yeah, we're going to do this. We're going to try a double header. See, we got a generator on this one too, so when we hit dark again. We heard, when we hit dark again, I gotta go. <laughs> I'm out of time when, when it gets dark again. Yeah, we'll bring this up. We'll put those other cars on there because we need to log in cars anyway. There we go. Yeah, it would be really nice if you could somehow if they cheese that in or whatever. I mean, you could have somebody on the other, standing in the other engine and, you know, sticking your hand out the window to go, hey, speed up, slow down, whatever, you know, that kind of thing. All right, so we're gonna come out this way, all the way past the switch, and the hill's gonna help us stop anyway. And I think what we'll do is we'll just have Betsy back it up to there. I think that's what we'll do. So there we go. Are we going to hold? Mostly. Okay. It'll do. And let's see here. We got all these are good. I don't want to accidentally hit a switch. Um, this one is going to go this way. And then we'll bring this back. Oh, you know what? I should check the other coupler. It's probably open. It should be open because of the, um, because that's the last place. Yeah. Okay. It is going to go onto that track if it does back up, right? Okay. <laughs> Seems like it's moving a little. It's physicsing. All right. Let's get some fuel in Betsy here. You can do it. Open. There's the hatch. All right. There we go. There we are. Come on, Betsy. You can do it. Apparently, there's a pretty... Yeah, I guess that is. It's fairly significant hill, I guess. Let's see what lets Betsy maintain a decent speed here. There we go. I think 50% will do it. Okay. And I think we're going to leave Betsy attached again as a caboose. There we go. Okay, so all the brakes are off on that. We should, why am I dragging? Why am I dragging all of a sudden? That was weird. Am I... Huh, okay. I think the control key was stuck. Oh, because I was ducking. I was ducking when I uh, jumped into the engine. When I hit F to enter the engine, I, I'd been ducking. And so it, it exited and it didn't unduck. That's a word, right? Um... All right, and we need to go on to the input side of this. This is gonna be a real interesting thing. <laughs> we'll just call it all those things, yeah. This is the input side. We're gonna drop off our stuff and then we're gonna go past it and then back up to the output side, I think. Or maybe we'll separate these trains or something like that. I think maybe that's what we'll do is we'll have this pull the logs back. I don't know. We'll figure it out. If we can get there. Huh. Okay. All right, we're going to... We're going to get this moving, but we need to do this because we need to make sure we don't over-speed when we get to the downhill part. There we 
go. Alright, we're fine on that. Let me turn this down a little bit too. So you're only hearing it from the internal sound, not off my speakers going through the microphone. With a slight delay, right? Let's see. Apparently this is a very heavy train. There we go. Let's see if we can bring this up the hill. Alright. We're gonna start going downhill here in a second. I think. This is still a little bit. Yeah, this is downhill a little bit here. We just need to be a little bit a little bit careful. Because we got that downhill and then that big corner coming up. There we go. This corner is the one that always makes me nervous. I really should try to round that one out. There we go. Okay. It should be okay here. Good. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go back here and we're going to turn off the regulator on this one. And then we're going to use this one to drive. We turn off the brakes on this. We're going to use this one to control us down the hills and stuff like that because we're, we're done with the big uphills. So we just got our downhill left. So we're just going to use this on a downhill. Remember, we were only needing like 9% on um, one engine, so I think we can, I think this will have enough brakes to keep us from going over speeding down this hill. We'll see. <laughs> we're going to find out, right? We're going to put the reverser on too in case we need it. There, now we can hear it. I'm suddenly afraid to go over 15 again. <laughs> there we go. Nice. <laughs> All right. I think I let a little bit of break out. There we go. I, you know, I think it was after that one derail that we had where it, like, reset my uh, paranoid factor, my safety margin level, whatever you want to call it. All right, that's 15 more minutes. Those little, it's the 15-minute timer, that's what that thing is. All right, so we're going to slow down a little bit here. go. Turn on our bell. Alright, so we're going to need to bring in the iron to that second platform. Okay. See if we can do this and get this lined up. Looks like we might be able to unload three of them at a time, right? I think we're still come down a hill or something because that is really cruising. I think the back end of it is still on a hill. Yeah, a little bit. Okay. 
So we'll see if we can get these on the platform, if we can get three of them on the platform maybe. We'll see. Can turn that off. And we need to get the middle of that car. There we go. I think we got the front one perfectly lined up. Because we're going to be able to get that on there. Yeah, see? Okay. Nice. Okay, so we got that one. That one. We got those three. So it should start making pipes on the other end. Because we do have coal, right? Yeah, we brought a whole lot of coal. That's the one thing, the one nice thing with coal. It seems like you can bring, you can make a whole lot of it and you can bring a whole lot of it. All right. Um, let me go forward a little bit. Oh, am I in there? I jumped in the wrong engine. That's why. <laughs> Here. I'm like, why is the brake not on? There we go. <laughs> We're only moving a little bit, right? That's what that means? <laughs> okay. I don't know. That's almost like Victor Borga pronouncing uh, punctuation. Okay, and we have, if we can get another triple, that would be great. It looks like we're there now at a car, car and a quarter. Yeah, it looks like that's going to, we're going up, it's starting to go up a hill anyway. Okay. That one will go. Is it already, yeah, see, it's already using them. Good. And this one alone. Yep. Yeah, we got room. Okay, cool. And then we just got two more. Two more. And I think we'll be able to see this from here. Let's see. Maybe. Okay, because that's what it sounds like. That's one car. I'm just looking at this right here. We got two cars. A little bit more. And that should get both of them up there. There we go. A little bit more. No? There. Okay. Let's see if that'll work. That should do it. Can we jump up the stairs? Jump over the coal. Da -da -dun -da -dun -dun. Okay. All right. So we've got our raw iron. Let's see what it shows. We have 45 pipes. That's much better. Okay. So we want to do is we want to get the pipes over there. Do we have a turnaround? We have a turnaround? No, we don't. We just have a thing. Okay. So if we pull this whole thing up, pull that back. Yeah, I suppose we can just pull the whole train. We can just do the whole train instead of re... whatchamacallitting. We can try that and see. We we'll get all our trains back together at the at the center of the map, and uh, there we go. Yeah, we'll get everything back together at the center of the map. I'm just kind of leery about pushing that down, up and down the hills and stuff. We don't have any super sharp corners to deal with that we'd have to push around. We have the one that is kind of a super sharp corner, but we can just coast around that, so I think we'll be fine. Let's see. Yeah, it's set up so that we can... Yep. So that we'll go up this. I want to go up this straight instead of going around that corner. There we go. 
and we just need to get that all past this switch here, the second switch. There we go. Okay, so that's past that switch. Whoops, and then we're gonna just gonna go back here, and that's correct. Okay, and I think we will probably bring the engines back. I think we're gonna do that. We have a turnaround there. Whoops, reverser. There we go. <laughs> Does the three mean I stopped and then started going forward again or just <laughs> Uh, over interpreting, over analyzing whistle coat. <laughs> uh, it was the one, one for yes, two for no, or one, yeah, one for yes, two for no, and the person whistles twice, and then it's like, yes, yes. <laughs> you can get the answer you want no matter what. Uh, okay. Yeah, we can do that, I think. Yeah, because we can pull Betsy out of the way. I think we can do this. We'll reverse the cars. But we just got to get those down there. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to have to... We're just going to have to guess on where the things go. I don't know. Maybe we can move the engines first and then reload from this end. Maybe that'll work. I got to think about how I'm going to do that, though. Okay, so we've got, can we load that one? Let's see if this will load. How many pipes does it load on these? Is it five? I think it's five. Um, but yeah, we're gonna, we need to make the engines turn around. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna take a while. So I think we'll just get this loaded first. That's five out of five, right? No, it's six out of seven. Okay. 47. Let's see what it does here. Yeah, cool. It only took one. Okay. Cool. So we can fit seven each on those? All right. That's pretty cool. Here, we're going to go like this just so we can get there faster. There. All right. So we need to come back a couple car lengths, right? So let's go like this. I think we need to come back to where this is like right over here, where these meet. We'll try that. But yeah, it would almost be easier to just put these engines on the other end, or at least one of them anyway. Now the thing is if I put only one of them, if I only put one of them on each end, then I won't be able to run back and forth easily to, or, or you know, it'll be a lot more difficult because it's not easy. but. It'll be more difficult to run back and forth and get to the engines to, to change the throttle and stuff like that when I need to. Did we? Yeah, we overshot. Okay, that's fine too. All right, so that's going to load nine on there. Because we're going to separate these, I think. Yeah, I'm not sure. Here, let's go like this. Let's see if those are done yet. Because I think they take three. They take three shots to fill. Yep. So one more shot. Does this show... This doesn't show the freight. Oh, yeah, it does. Cool. Nice. Six to nine. Eight to nine. Is there a way to bring that back? Not really. Okay, so we need to come up by two car lengths. So, that's going to be to about here, I think. So we'll go like the front wheel at this junction. See if we can do that. And then we'll come back and get the other car, I think, when we get the stuff on the other end. When we get the engines on the other end. 
There we go. Can we see it from here? We can't really see it. It looks like it's maybe there. We'll see. Yeah, it looks like we might be able to do it. Yeah, it looks like it's going to work. Okay, cool. Let's see if we can do this. Nice. Okay, so then what we got to do is we need to bring these cars all up past that? No. We need to bring... Because those engines need to turn around, so the engines need to go around this. Oh, I know what we can do. No, wait. <laughs> yeah, we'll take Betsy off the end here. Okay. So we're going to take Betsy off the end. Whoops. Here. Yeah, that's what I thought. We're going to take Betsy off the end. Come on, you can do it. Alright. And then... We're going to go... We're going to bring all those back here. We're going to back the whole thing up. Yeah, okay. So, whoops. We need to disconnect first. We're going to go forward. Really? There. All right. And then this one, we're going to bring this back past this switch. And then we're going to um, to go around the, the backup thing. Let's see here. And then the engines are going to come around the other way. Yeah, yeah, okay, cool. I'll show you. Whoops, we're going to go forward first. Oh, man. No way. Okay. Well, <laughs> we're going to do this first. <laughs> Let's try this again. Whoops. Rerail. Flat car. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Flat car. There we go. We open this. Open it. And open this. And open this. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> that, that was totally my fault. I did the crack the whip thing. I pulled backwards and then went forward. Yeah, and it's starting to get dark. So we'll just get this. Whoops. We'll get this re-railed and then we gotta go. Um, we're gonna go backwards a little bit. And then we'll come to a stop. There we go. Is it going to stop? Alright, we're going to let it settle. Okay, it's not still trying to go forward. Or backward. Now we're going to gently go forward. Because <laughs> we just need to get that past that switch. There we go. Can't see the cars. Alright, cool. I think we got it. Excellent. Okay, so that's going to be it for episode 32. Join me in episode 33. We're going to get this the head turned back around and all that fun stuff. And we'll get this all set up to go. So that's going to be it for 32. Join me in episode 33. Uh, and we'll see you then. Later. <laughs>